Bless up and welcome everyone, in this video we will explore the impactful Freedom From Hunger campaign launched by Haile Selassie I on February 22, 1963. From time immemorial hunger, disease, and illiteracy have been man's persistent enemies, which have plagued his effort to lead a fuller and healthier life. Being aware of the urgent necessity to eradicate these causes of human miseries, and having realized that this could only be done through their concerted actions in the various agencies of the United Nations, the nations of the world have joined hands and pooled together their resources and energies to fight back these scourges. When, in 1960, the Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations, determined to free mankind from the scourge of hunger, which is one of the three enemies of man, presented the program of Freedom from Hunger Campaign to the 10th session of the FAO and the General Assembly of the United Nations, Ethiopia was one of the foremost countries to support and endorse the proposal. Apart from the various actions and programs that we endeavor to initiate, to enhance and promote the welfare of our beloved people, our efforts to propose and support various programs at various forums of the United Nations and its specialized agencies have given encouraging results. At all times, Ethiopia will continue to be the first to take action against such enemies which threaten human life and prosperity. All nations have readily and fully endorsed the proposal that the Freedom From Hunger campaign should be established within the Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations. Furthermore, a sister campaign, the World Food Program has been set up under the joint auspices of the Food and Agriculture Organization and the United Nations. The purpose of these programs is to study, assist, and advise how effectively developing countries can best utilize their natural resources to raise the standard of living of their people. The most effective way of utilizing any outside assistance is to create and develop an atmosphere of self-help, where the available human and natural resources could be tapped in the best interest of the people. Everyone, in all walks of life, regardless of professional occupation, should feel concerned and play an active role to solve should feel concerned and play an active role to solve such problems that affect mankind. Now, we call upon the generosity of our people to help develop agriculture and improve its productivity. The Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations has found it essential that national committees for the Freedom from Hunger campaign be formed, and that each member state coordinate its activities with the World Freedom from Hunger Campaign Committee. Apart from the contribution that Ethiopia makes towards the Freedom from Hunger campaign, we hereby appoint you to serve as members of the National Committee of Ethiopia of the Freedom from Hunger campaign, and we have entrusted to you the responsibility to work hard to realize the objectives of the campaign in close cooperation with the Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations. We have, with pleasure, accepted the request to be the patron of this Freedom from Hunger Campaign Committee of Ethiopia, and have instructed our Minister of Agriculture to follow up on the activities of this campaign and present periodic progress reports to us. The Freedom from Hunger Campaign launched by Haile Selassie I on February 22, 1963, was a remarkable initiative that helped to combat hunger and poverty in Ethiopia. The campaign's success in reducing malnutrition in the country and inspiring similar efforts across Africa and around the world is a testament to the power of collective action and leadership. Haile Selassie I's legacy as a champion of social justice and human rights continues to inspire us to address the global challenges of hunger and poverty. Thank you for watching, Heart of Love, We Thrive Together, I hope this video has shed light on the significance of the campaign and its impact on the world. Please like, share and subscribe for more videos.